Khloe Kardashian gave some insight into Sean, Diddy, Combs' wild parties in a clip from Keeping Up With The Kardashians that has resurfaced amid the rapper's sex trafficking arrest. The Good American founder, now 40, recalled attending one of Diddy's star-studded fates on an episode of the E! reality series, titled, Secrets of a Double Life, which aired on August. 17, 2014. So who was with you this weekend? Chloe's sister Courtney Kardashian asked while organizing a closet in the throwback scene. A bunch of my friends, Chloe coyly replied, prompting Courtney to list off the names of several celebrities. Diddy, Quincy, Combs, Justin Bieber, French Montana, she said. So far so good, Chloe replied, before asking the Push founder, now 45, if she knew half the people she was naming. No, Courtney admitted, to which Chloe said, good. Elsewhere in the episode, Chloe described her experience attending Combe Soiree while bowling with Courtney and their friend Khadija Hack. I haven't been to bed yet. I got on a plane at 5.30 a.m., she shared. Well, this party, I think half the people were butt naked. Chloe then razzed Courtney, joking that the Lemmy creator would have loved it. Courtney, seemingly unfazed by Chloe's comments on partiers stripping down at the bash, then turned to Hack to ask if she had met her sister's new crew of friends at the party. No, well, kind of, Hack replied, to which Chloe jumped in, snapping, Stop. Stop talking. When Hack tried defending herself, telling Chloe that she hadn't revealed anything, the clothing designer again ordered her friend to stop talking. Combs was known for throwing his annual white parties often attended by a slew of stars including Chloe and Courtney's sister Kim Kardashian, as well as Sarah Jessica Parker, Leonardo DiCaprio and more. Last week, the I'll Be Missing You artist, 54, was arrested in New York City and charged with three counts, racketeering conspiracy, sex trafficking by force, fraud or coercion, and transportation to engage in prostitution. According to a 14-page unsealed indictment, prosecutors claimed the rapper abused, threatened and coerced women and others around him to fulfill his sexual desires, protect his reputation and conceal his conduct for decades, creating a criminal enterprise whose members and associates engaged in sex trafficking, forced labor, kidnapping, arson, bribery and obstruction of justice. Combs' lawyer reacted to the charges, saying in a statement, We are disappointed with the decision to pursue what we believe is an unjust prosecution of Mr. Combs by the U.S. Attorney's Office the embattled music maven's reputation began to plummet in November 2023 when his ex-girlfriend, Cassandra, Cassie, Ventura, filed a lawsuit accusing him of raping and physically abusing her throughout their 10-year relationship. They settled the suit the next day, but more of Diddy's offenses were exposed the following year when a shocking video surfaced of the rap mogul beating Cassie in a hotel in 2016. Combs, who initially denied the singer's sexual abuse claims, called his actions inexcusable and issued an apology. He has since been hit with an onslaught of other accusations and is facing at least eight separate lawsuits. Don Richard, who was previously signed to Bad Boy Records, claimed her former boss inappropriately touched her while she was undressed and physically abused Ventura on several occasions in front of her, which Combs, a father of seven, has denied.